Welcome back to my crib. Uh, it's 2024. So with the new year coming in, that means it's time for some new drip. It's time for some new pieces. Today, I'm going to be breaking down just a quick little wish list that I have for some boots that I'm looking at right now. It's really only been like two, three months since I really started taking fashion seriously. And it's been so much fun. Like this little bit of time that I've really like been really taking it serious. Like I've always been a fan of fashion. But like, I have never really taken it seriously. Like I always took like fit pics and stuff like that. And uh, I just recently took one like in public, public, like in front of like people walking behind stuff like that. And I was so nervous for it, but it's been a blast. So uh, I'm super hyped about the pieces I get this year and stuff like that. And the things that I make, but that's besides the point. So today we're breaking down the list I have right now, boots that I've been looking at uh, just to really spread it out a little bit and like have some fun for real, for real. So let's get into it. Okay, so the first boot that I have on my list are the Ugg Tasman Weather Hybrid Boots. Those boots, I don't even know what really made me like look at. I think I was just on the website looking for just regular Uggs, and those are on the list as well. Like I also want to just get the regular Uggs because I remember I was watching. It was either the um, the episode of Lil Yachty's podcast that he has with his friend that he either did. I think it was the one he either did with Lucky or the one that he did with someone else. I don't remember, but he had this like red flannel jacket. It was either like a. I'm sure it's like some high end brand. I just didn't see the logo or anything, but. It's like a red flan uh, red and black flannel like top with these super baggy white pants. But then he had these like boots on and the way he put the colors together and stuff like that. Like I thought that was so fire. So I really wanted to recreate like that similar look because uh, I don't think the boots that he had on were Uggs. I really wanted to get the regular Uggs. And as I was looking at that po episode of his podcast that he did, I seen that. Uh, and that's what made me look for the Uggs. I was looking at boots and um, I seen those and I was like, man, those look crazy. I think they come with a black color, too. I don't know how I feel about the black color, though, just because, like, it's just straight black. I mean, like, I think they, they slightly differ in, like, shade by a little bit. But, like, I love how, like, those the Tasmans look with the orange and, like, just the tan on top, too. Like, that's so fire. Like, I, I just really like the look. And then it kind of, I can't describe it. It's just the way that it looks like it's made. It's just very interesting to me. And I like the color combinations as well. So I might get the black ones. Uh, I really don't know. I'm really looking forward to the orange ones. So I don't think I'll get the black ones. But super duper fire. So the next boots that I were looking forward to in 2024 were the high gothic Americana platform boots. I think that's exactly what they're called by Doc Martin. Uh, I was just looking for some nice platform boots. I'm tall enough already. I'm six foot two. I might be maybe like an inch taller now. That's 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 shooting that's shooting high. But I'm definitely a, uh, six foot two. So I'm already like pretty tall. But for some reason, like uh, I just want platforms for some reason. And I was looking on the Doc Martin website and they had these cool ass like it's like stitched up uh, platform boots and those were the ones that i was looking at and they like uh, are so cool that they have like designs and patterns on them and stuff like that uh i think they have like spikes on it. i'm not remembering exactly how they looked but so clean so fire and i'm so hyped to put a fit together with some platform boots and like how much taller is gonna make me is like so funny like it's hilarious it's so clean they're so clean they're so cool like i really want to get some new doc martens too because i had a pair but i don't know i moved so many times i have no idea where those went so i'm getting one of those first that's i i didn't want this to be a specific order but at the same time like those two those being the first two the next boots i cop probably are gonna be one of those ones but super duper fire shout out to doc martens and the next one is i'm pretty sure it's gonna be obvious by the time you hear it uh old reliable old reliable just the classic timberland boot now you can never go wrong with the classic timberland boot it goes with so much stuff like i was in home depot one time and i seen a dude who just had like a half zip up hoodie with like a tank top underneath and some pajama pants these super baggy pajama pants and then he had tims on and the fit was so fire the fit was so fire and i'm just looking at like tims just go with everything they go with everything like you can't go wrong with just having a pair of just classic tims uh i know they have like the different kind of boots and stuff like that with like uh hiking boots and and different terrain boots and different design boots and stuff like that but i'm just i'm a fan of the classic like i'm fine with just keeping it regular because they're fire they're so fire okay so these next ones the next two are gonna kind of be similar but not really just similar areas of boot i guess not specifically like brand aside i really just want to get um some cowboy boots with some spurs on them now that sounds technically not crazy but to a regular person probably a little crazy just wanting cowboy boots especially with the spurs on them it's something about like that aesthetic and like when they walk and like you can hear the spurs and stuff like that like to me that's i'm a big fan of like little stuff like that like little little token like parts to clothing and stuff like that like little stuff like that like i'm, I'm a really big fan of and i just like how cowboy boots look 
like ever since I seen Red Dead Redemption and and, and uh what, what was it Wild West with um Will Smith and stuff like that. Like I've always been a fan of the cowboy look, so it's always been uh a, a pair of boots that I really wanted to get. But the Spurs, I feel like would just take it take it to that level like having the boots with the spurs on them like it's just a different like i'm gonna just imagine myself walking now with like those cowboy boots on and that would be so clean so clean shout out to the cowboys but the next ones like i said they're gonna be kind of similar the next ones that i wanted were still kind of cowboy boots looks but i seen kendrick lamar he took a picture one time with baby keem and he had these customized like boots with patches on them like i think uh, i seen like a pg lang patch was on there and like they just had different i think that's so fire i seen those boots that he had and i'm like man i don't know if he did those himself or if he bought them from like a, a company that puts patches on boots or whatever the, the case may be but i seen them and i was just so hype like i really wanted to do it like i i started looking at patches and stuff like that like uh people that can make custom patches like i really want to put a turf club patch on it like if i had those like i feel like those would be like really cool and really like i don't know very expressive like i i'm a fan of like the patches and and, and stitching and stuff like that like i remember i showed you the um i showed you the pants with the pad the white pants with the patches on them and then i also showed the pants with like the paint like i said i'm a big fan of just little stuff like that like it, it just adds character adds flavor to the clothes you're wearing the ideas that you have that you want to portray like it just adds so much and that's really what i want to i want to get so good that i can really tell who i am or i can tell other people who i am just based off how i'm dressed and kind of not even really because i don't even want people to assume that like they can kind of guess how i am like i just wanted to be like how i'm feeling for the day like you can see my emotions through my outfits and what i wear that's my goal i want to be the freest flyest man alive Ugh. and last but not least i'm sure you'll probably have like guessed it if i didn't put this on the list i'm sure somebody would have probably said how come uh but the big red boots by mischief ever since they i think it was what it was either early last year it might have been last year they dropped Ever since then, I've just been looking, looking, looking at them. I've just been looking at them. Even when they first dropped, I was planning on buying them. I was on the email list to get notified when they got uh, restocked. And I, I still didn't buy them just because, like, mm, didn't feel like my time. But going into 2024, uh, I can't I can't go the whole year without getting those boots. Like, they're just so fire to me. Like, they do look ridiculous. I can say that. But they give, like, egghead from One Piece vibes. Like, just super, like, poppy, fun. Uh, and Astro Boy was always a personal favorite of mine. So, like, those boots being kind of, like, replicated from that was, like, so fire. Uh, I'm definitely copping on. I think they have a black one, too. I've seen the black ones. Those are cool. Those are fire. I think the red kind of solidifies, like, the reference and stuff like that. Like, going outside of the... I, I still cop the black ones, too, if I had, like, the opportunity. But the red ones are definitely, like, on my watch list like I'm, I'm watching out for those like those will those, those will most likely be the third that i buy if i would put these in an order i know those were last strictly just for video's sake and when i made the list i just didn't think of it until last but those ones might be higher up on the list in terms of priority and like getting bought i'm super duper hyped for those i'm just hyped for this whole year i know i'm i'm not gonna hold y'all up too much about it but uh right now those are my boots that i'm looking forward to right now so i feel like i just went through a whole seminar teaching a class about boots Thank you for watching. Um, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. If you have any other boot suggestions that you feel like I would like, feel free to let me know. Follow me on IG at Judo Judo Judo. Thanks for watching. Uh, see you next time. Thank you. Have a nice day.